Hey world, this is Jeff Chaturn bringing you another gameplay commentary. This time, Demolition at Vacant, which again another map pack map map pack map. I can't talk for shit in my life. People make fun of me. I don't care. I am verbally impaired. So I'm playing Demolition, bringing you a video on why and how to play the objective. Because that's what you do in Demolition. It's not Team Deathmatch. All of you 100 kill getters. Which is me, by the way. I did that. But I also played the objective. On defense, I racked up 80. And then, bam, shotgun. Just end it. Spas, no. Get out. My world. I have an age 12 Get knifed. And then, spray this guy. Fail completely. Payback. Kill him, too. Payback's a bitch. I love it. Except when money flies out, I feel gay. World at War, you get shot, your legs fall off. This game, money flies out. Get knifed again. I am so shankable. Because I play on tactical, and circle's too far away from me. Spray like 30 bullets at him, because I have horrible accuracy. And then pull out my A12 extended mags. Beautiful, wonderful. As you can see, I plan to be right away. And I'm just kind of running through the hallways, killing anyone who comes close to it. It's pretty much impossible to defuse me. It is just too damn good. Too damn good. What am I saying? It is too damn enclosed. It's just in that little box of doom in the middle of the map. And here I cannot compete with an RPD. So I die. So now we're at A. A is much harder than B to destroy. Because it is a building full of campable places. So I'm like, oh, no one's around, no one's around. And then start to plan. Boom. Camper in the corner. Hey, General Spanky. Shout out. You watch my vids. I like you. Um, we should all applaud the good general. I think it's a YouTube channel. If he does, I'll put it in the description. And, yeah, General Spanky. And also, Captain Bushwhacker, you deserve a shout-out. I think your name is TJ in real life. I feel like it is. We do game battles. I want to know when we're starting. Send me a message. I'll send you one because I love game battles. It was fun. And also, you know, the tags. Shout out to them, too. Here I am, just rushing this bomb. Over and over again, I will rush the bomb site. Because repetition is a good thing in this game. You know, like 180 that guy. Here, they're all focused on the main entrance. So I just come in, throw my C4. Fail, spray this guy. Go to the plant. Realize my teammate has it. So to give him cover, I run into their spawn and do work. So I see, waiting, waiting, bomb planted, see a guy, jump, bam, county wavy, spray this guy, and then dead, hit from the side. Everyone spawns there. It's one of the only things I dislike about demolition. You do not have, like, a secondary spawn. You have one spawn, and you're spawning there no matter what. You will not move. You might move, like, slightly down in the room or something, but that's it. So we see that guy planted A. Great teamwork. So now we're just holding it out. I'm camping it up behind this little... I don't even know what it is. Storage crate. C4 that guy. Double tap reload. Bam. Looking at us always. Spray him. Count UAV. Spray that guy. Takes like a full clip. You know. I suck. Spraying him. C. Two seconds left. Pull up my A12. I'm glad I just got a prep missile. I switched to my defensive class. Which is my scar silenced with scavenger. Not pro. I don't even have pro. I'm level 54 or something. I do not have pro. So scar silenced. Scavenger, Stopping Power Ninja. Uh, I believe I have Claymores because it's for defense. I only use it for, like, Surge. I guess Demolition now because I do. So here I am, knifed. Always in there. See, they did the also immediate plant of B. See, the other team was not retarded. They were unfortunately poor luck. That's horrible. They unfortunately had poor luck, but they were not retarded. Get knifed again, but Buzz killed him with my Claymore. Payback is a bitch. See the money? Someday I'm just going to hack the game. Just go around collecting all the money after a match. Somehow make it PSN money and then just buy every map pack for every game I've never seen before. And yeah. From us, you know, I have a scar. Think about changing, but I'm like, nah, I'm on defense. Stick with my gun. Die from the back. Realize B is a lost cause. I mean, there's not enough time to defuse it. So I go get ready for the invitable... Six man rush of A. So I throw down my claymore. Just look down this little hallway of doom. You know, looking around, checking the both entrances. Spray this guy. I hate last stand. Friggin' second chance, like, that was cool. Because you got revived. Last stand in this game is just obnoxious. Because you do not need to go down 
like you attribute attribute what the fuck do I say you gain nothing by lying on the ground you might kill me great you're now on the ground just easy cannon fodder for whoever throws a stun at you and it will always be a stun if I'm the one throwing never flash because stuns are so much better they throw like a throwing knife it's like you tap it and it's already gone out of your hand Whereas a flashbang, it's like a semtex, you like pull it out, like, you know, undo your belt, jack off for a bit, and then like throw it, because we do that. So, you know, looking down, Scar's amazing, spray this guy, plus 20, one of my various assists. See the smoke, you know, looking around some more, just checking out, I know they're going to be coming that way, it's the way they have to come from, because that's their spawn, demolition is one spawn. And plus, I have my UAV helping me out. No one's gonna flank. No one's smart enough to flank. And then they get a pave low, and I am scared shitless because pave lows can shoot me through the holes in the roof. Because whoever built this building, Russian apartment complex, apart no office complex. What the hell? I sorry guys that I fail, but you know what? It's like midnight, and I woke up at six in the morning, and that's not good because I usually wake up at like two in the afternoon. So, pick up a UMP, plant another Claymore. This gun is insane. You'll see, it's my main rush gun, but it has purposes on defense. Camp behind these bulletproof barrels. Spray this guy, fail epically, throw both my stuns. It says just one, the second one contributes nothing. And look, it's that last dang guy. I get plus 20. So, looking around now, I think I'm out of ammo with my Sky. So, you know, get the UMP, spray this guy. Get my counter UAV. Great. And then calling it in, I get popped in the chest by a guy with an identical rush class to me. So good for you, wherever the hell you are. And I see that they planted the bomb. And the payload kills me. So like a good Samaritan. Bam. Stinger. Nope. It is destroyed. So you know what? Good for whoever destroyed it. But you just cost me an unnecessary death as I kill myself. And then, surprisingly, I switched to my rushing class as I realized that the scar was not doing anything for me. So here we go, spray this guy, and as soon as I can, just hop on the bomb to defuse it. You will see, I do this a lot. You've seen already this video, I rush the bomb site because that's what happens. I am a hero, I am the heartbreaker, and I get knifed. I am the white teenage Tayo Cruz, breaking hearts across the nation. I always use one of the pink titles because they're the coolest, I don't care what anyone says. Fake my C4 throw, spray this guy, you know, last stand, what the hell. 180 him. He sucks, I suck. Pull my sp- ah. Pull my A12, get gunned down. Damn. My beautiful one spawn of the entire map, even though it's vacant, which is relatively big, I mean. Big enough for two spawns, at least. Try to throw my C4 out the window, fail, so I just prematurely detonate. And then look, back to back plus 20s. See him, spray him. I would've been pissed, I would've rage quit if I did not kill him. But I did, so you know, looking around for my UMP. Spraying some more, another plus 20. I now have two kills and three assists on this one life. I'm already out of ammo, so spray this guy through the wall. Get my UAV. Pick up a USP TAC knife. Realize they're behind me. Turn around and bam. You're dead. My French teacher told me that once. She's like a 50-year-old woman. She has an Italian accent. She said you're dead. It completed my life. So I get killed by a guy hiding in the corner because he's a pussy. Not even trying to plant the bomb, just hiding. I see him 28-21. That is far better than I expect to be doing. At the end of a demolition match, especially one where I'm completely playing objective based. So, you know, no one expects a defuse within the first 10 seconds. So, bam, the Heartbreaker is a hero again. Another plus 20. I can't get a kill, I guess. I'm not allowed to. This is my seventh assist of the game. Spray him through the wall. Flashbang. Another assist. Keep running, you know, pop outside. Stunned or flashbang. Then painkiller. You see how many there were? Friggin' if I had like my RPD out, I could have got a six kill spread. I would have done it too. Cause I can. I feel like someone was in front of me, so when I paused, I made a face of like, I don't know. I don't have a word for it, but if you were knew me, it would make sense. Do my little shake my hands and thought thing. Another assist. God damn it, it's like ten. So pull up my shotgun now. They plant again. Spray that guy forever, and then right away, again, no one expects in the first 10 seconds to defuse. But, this guy is cool, so he uses danger close to noob tubes. So, you know, good for him. See my teammates hopped on the bomb, he's a good player. Respect to him. 
couldn't read his name on that slight like run by, but good for you, dude. 15 seconds left. We're just holding out. Get another assist. Just keep throwing my stuns out the front door. Get a knife. Around the corner by Commando. I don't know. That pair gives me AIDS. My teammate fails. Didn't see him. Bayonets were cool. World of War bayonets were cool, but not Commando. Okay, we just won 2 nothing. You know, Spets and Soviet Union. Mother Russia. Woo! Don't know my final score. Something like 10 assists.